Hello everybody and welcome to my channel. My name is Pineapple and today I am doing a hot dog, hot dog stand speed build. So, as you might have guessed, this is a hot dog stand that looks like a hot dog. At least I hope it does. Um, yeah, I found these wood pieces and when you size them up, I think they look exactly like a hot dog. And so, uh, using the deck tool, I made a rounded deck and I then mirrored that shape using roofing tools. Um, and so it wasn't that hard um, with this. You know, I just kind of tried to go for like colors that look like a bun. Um, and so the overall shape was pretty easy for me. So yeah, I really enjoyed doing this build. It's really whimsical and I mostly just did it for fun. I didn't think it'd get as popular as it has. And this is my most popular build that I have ever done. It like surprised me so much. Um, so far this build has like um, about 373 downloads and almost 100 favorites on the gallery. Which, by the way, it's up on the gallery if you want to download it. My um, origin ID is PineappleYT. So yeah, I just was really, really surprised with like how how many people like it. I'm so flattered too, and I've only gotten really positive comments on it. <laughs> so yeah. Um, one of my favorite things about this build is the fact that I only used base game and the dine out stuff pack or game pack. Um, so I think this makes this build a lot more accessible for a lot of people who have maybe just gotten the game um, and the only like expansion sort of thing they have is Dine Out um, or people who are waiting for an expansion they really like and they chose Dine Out. They can now, like I think this makes it really easy for people to um, download it. You know, you don't have to worry about um, some of the key features or the wallpapers not showing up because you don't have them. Um, so that makes me really happy. Um, with this, I, with the awnings that I have here, I really wish that they had red and yellow ones because then that would look like mustard. Um, I add in, you know, mustard later, but that would have been really nice. So they're red and white, which for me, it makes complete sense because I don't know about you guys, but I enjoy a little bit of mayonnaise on my hot dogs. What do you guys like on your hot dogs? I, my favorite hot dog is a hot dog with mayonnaise, um, ketchup, and then a little bit of mustard. And then sometimes maybe if I'm in the mood, some relish, but I'm usually not in the mood <laughs> for relish. But yeah, I'd love to hear what your guys' favorite hot dog is. <laughs> Um, so I tried to also keep this build relatively inexpensive. Um, there are some things that make it a bit more expensive. I think it's about 29,000 um, simoleons. I'm not 100% certain. Um, so it's not the most expensive one up there, but I wouldn't say that it's a starter restaurant. Um, yeah, it's, it has a very simple interior and it's just supposed to be like a stand. You know, it's not supposed to be like a really swanky restaurant. Um, like I said, it's just really whimsical and fun and hopefully functional. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> but yeah, it has, I think it kind of has a sort of um, 80s, or not 80s, like 50s. Yeah, that's, that's the decade. I think it has a sort of 50s diner sort of feel. Um, which makes sense because I think hot dogs are very sort of like nostalgic almost. Um, they're very, I guess like, oh, <laughs> what's it called? Baseball, yeah, oh my God. You can tell that I don't do sports. <laughs> uh, I did sailing, but that's, most people don't consider that a sport, but <laughs> I'm off pocket. Top, oh, well, well, I'm dying. <laughs> I'm dying, I can't talk and I'm dying. <laughs> I'm so sorry, um, but yeah, so I wanted this to be sort of really like classic American sort of vibe. Um, on the inside, I put
put that sort of yellow and red theme that I really enjoyed or I wanted for those awnings, but I end up changing that at the end. I don't think you'll see it in the build. It was a very last minute decision and I decided to change it so that it matched the awnings a bit better. Um, so yeah, I don't know if you guys can tell, but I haven't actually at this point in the build used any of the new stuff from the dine out pack and that's because I did start this one like getting the basic layout and some of the stuff like in especially this mustard because oh my gosh this took a really long time to do <laughs> it's kind of tedious um but I got it done before the pack came out and then when the pack came out I redid the interior a bit and I finished the exterior yeah um I originally thought that I would be putting tables and chairs on the bottom bun um and then I thought well maybe I'll make like a line to the window um but then I thought that looked too cluttered um and it wouldn't really make sense for dine like the dine out sort of game dynamics um so the hot dog bun on the bottom just is left pretty much completely bare like I think I leave a menu thing uh, a lot of the time you'll see me trying to put a little table there because I thought I'd have like a table for like condiments um, which would make sense, but it kind of looked weird and I end up putting sort of condiments on the like dining tables themselves And so I thought that looked good. Oh And by the way if you were wondering what I did use for the mustard, that's actually just some like bathroom towels Yeah <laughs> um, uh, Here I am doing a little sort of garden area. Well now I'm doing the trash area, but here um, in the front, I've planned a little garden area and I wanted to put what looked like a hot dog statue and I cut a little bit out because I was just pulling furniture out, seeing how I liked it. Um, but I ended up going with these dressers. Um, I have like four dressers placed there and then I have the little wooden pieces that I use to make the hot dogs. And I size them up just a little bit more. One of the things that I find really, really frustrating is I'm pretty sure, at least it does in my game, if you download this off of the gallery, those little hot dog pieces will all fall to the ground. Um, and this, I think it mostly happens with objects that are decor objects that are supposed to be placed on a wall. Um, when you download them, for some reason, they just like fall. So it shows up great in the picture on the gallery, but then when you download it, they just fall down. Um, so I don't really know what happened there. I think that happened to the flowers as well, um, that represent the mustard and the mayonnaise and the relish, or not mayonnaise, ketchup and relish. Um, so when you download that, I'm really sorry, I can't control that. I really wish I could, I don't know why it happens. Yeah, <laughs> pretty much. Um, I was thinking, like, now I finally have the dine out pack. And I was actually thinking I was going to have new plants to put around the hot dog, but I didn't, so I went with that really simple one. But the new dine out pack doesn't have any tables with umbrellas, and so I that's why I added in, you know, mixed match of tables because I thought that the, the stand looked kind of weird without them. Um, the Sims is a very summery place at the moment with no seasons, and so I. I can't imagine really wanting to eat out in like the sun with like that being your only option. <laughs> but yeah, I also wasn't, I didn't factor in the host station or the waiter station. So I added them in on either side. I hope that was functional. I'm not quite sure. Um, but yeah, so I colored that section blue to kind of make it stand out. And I really liked how it turned out. Also, you might have noticed that it looks like there's nothing on the interior of this build and this happens um, in my game sometimes when I go up to a higher floor. I'm not really quite sure why it does it. Um, uh, when I turn the lot around, it works on the other side, but then the back side doesn't work and so it's just kind of weird, but it shouldn't affect your game. I'm still trying to figure out ways to fix it, but so far. Nada, but for now, I'm working around it. 
But yeah, if you want to download this build, it is up on the gallery um, under the origin name Pineapple YT. Um, I'm sure if you also just did like hashtag hot dog, you'd find it. Um, so yeah, I really hope that you guys enjoyed this build. If you did, feel free to leave me a like, a comment, or subscribe. That would really be great. Also, if you want, tell me what your favorite hot dog is. I would love to know. So yeah, the screenshots are coming up soon, and I will see you guys next time. Bye! Oh, looks good.